Hi everybody, this is Ben Chai, the Doctor Who of Business, and I know I don't normally do broadcasts on a Friday, but I've got a, I just met this amazing lady, her name's Lily Patrasco. Patrasco, she's just come and sit a bit closer, move your, your seat up here, um, uh, at a, uh, an event called the Rise of the Global Woman Entrepreneur. And just really, really amazing lady. She was just sharing some of her stuff, and I was actually quite skeptical uh, when I'm because I because I think it's always good to have a skeptical mindset. And she, uh, I was telling me more and more. And I'm thinking I need to have this lady videoed and hear her story and share her story with everyone. So, Lily. Please. So thank you so much, Ben, for uh, doing this. This is, my, this is my very first Facebook Live. So to tell you my story, I came to London um, 13 years ago to work as an au pair with only 100 euros in my pocket. And now I am a property entrepreneur um, and I'm an author of multiple books. Yes. And I am, I am uh, collaborating with my partner who has created the amazing course called Speakers Are Leaders about how you too can improve your public speaking so that you can get that voice out. I'm going to kill her in a second. So, so because uh, Lily loves selling, that <laughs> not a selling video, but they'll come and connect, uh, track you down because when they hear how fantastic you are, they, they will naturally connect to you. So, Lily, when you ha came to this country with a hundred euros and you, you uh, were out there and out at some of the places with people, you couldn't even buy a... I couldn't even buy chips because I went to Paris, I remember, with only a hundred euros in my pocket. And I remember that um, I went there for a weekend and on Sunday I didn't even have money to buy chips and everyone else did. But the really important thing that made the big, biggest difference was I just had fun no matter what. And that is something that's really important for you to do. Regardless of the situation you're in, you have to try to have fun. It doesn't matter how much money you have in your pocket. You, you can see that Lily is very passionate about teaching everyone to be uh, public speakers. <laughs> so so uh, it, it's really interesting because when Lily came to this country from Romania, uh, she had zero money, well a hundred euros, uh, which I, I know in some countries is a lot of money, but in, in terms of being in the UK, it really is nothing. Uh, how, did you, how did you live? Uh, uh, what, what, how did you find somewhere to live? And, and, and so on. So I came with an au pair job so uh, I was lucky enough to have somewhere to live um, and the food was also kind of guaranteed because we you know when you when you're an au pair you get that but uh, my salary is something like 65 pounds a week and I remember that even on New Year's um, I went out and I had to exchange that money that I initially brought the 100 euros and I, I bought two tickets to uh, New Year's Eve. Uh, they were like 75 pounds, 70 pounds. It was literally like the entire money because at that time the Euro exchange was, was different. And uh, I still had a lot of fun and I had zero money in my pocket, but I had, I think, the best fun in the club. So, <laughs> so, totally. So here's this lady with probably the least money ever. My, my arm's shaking already with, with uh, excitement in hearing her story. And um, uh, she had practically zero money in the club, but she's still having fun. And I think actually that this is one of the, the, the things I see with modern entrepreneurs. They're so focused on making money, 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 money that they, they lose sight of their happiness and many of my, my viewers have, have seen that, that, that I'm, you know, I'm looking at people, I'm feeling very sad inside, you know, I'm happy if they're making hundreds of thousands, but they're not happy and even on a hundred euros or less, uh, uh, you are happy just by having the opportunity, I'm guessing, because yes. you could see lots of opportunities. Now, how long ago was that? That was about 13 years ago, but the thing that never changed with me was the attitude, regardless of what, how much money I had, whether it was a hundred euros or whether now thousands, you know, it didn't matter. For me, the most important yeah. thing is have fun, yeah. live the moment, 
because otherwise, I mean, what good will it do to you if you have a hundred thousand in your pocket and you're always sad, you're always going to work uh, feeling mad or sorry or angry? So, so how many? It was thirteen years ago, did you say? Yes, thirteen, 13 years ago. So thirteen years ago, this uh, lovely lady had nothing, and then she she now has two of her own properties with her partner and eight, uh, eighteen rent to rent. <laughs> yes. Right. So that's bringing one income stream. Okay, now, in addition, during that time, so remember she's starting as an au pair, and this is why, you know, I never look down on waiters or waitresses or any, because you never know what they're going to be. So how many books have you written? I've written four books, and they are all... I am now collaborating with my partner Harry, who is uh, doing an amazing course called Speakers Are Leaders, and this has enabled me to now be comfortable to speak with you. With me? With you well, and with, you would have been comfortable before. I would have been comfortable. I mean, <laughs> I mean to speak with um, a, a large audience. I mean, I would never have had the courage or the guts or the power to speak with you the way I'm doing now so if I, I hadn't I, done this course. I, really, you keep selling on my my video. Uh, so, so, <laughs> <laughs> so it's so, really awesome. You just it. <laughs> so, so the second thing. So the first thing is, you, you it didn't matter how much money you had. You were always having fun, and the second thing is you were constantly learning yes. and uh, I, you know yesterday I was with, with somebody and he said the the success successful people are constantly learning yes that's exactly what I did so even for example I was an au pair right and I was taking the for example the children in the pram and this kind of thing and um, if they were sleeping or whatever I would always listen to some audiobooks some success um, um, books for example like Brian Tracy or a Les Brown or Tony Robbins or you know and that is the thing that made the biggest difference and the biggest difference actually I think was Brian Tracy when he he was talking about you know you have to use your transition time and that's exactly what I used to write my books and I, and I love this I love this because yeah. I'm a great great fan, fan of Brian Tracy and I actually have photographs with him which got lost wow. in my when my laptop was stolen I was gutted um, and please don't no texts about my lack of backup please so so there you are uh, you, you. While you were an au pair, you were building your foundation by educating yourself. Yes. Now, now, and did you write those books while you were an au pair? Um, yes, I wrote uh, those books actually. Um, so uh, first, I was an au pair, and then I was a, a tutor nanny. Okay, and yes, I wrote those books while working 60 hours a week because I used exactly the strategy of using transition time. And also, you know, like when you're listening to a lot of learning, to a lot of um, audios, what happens is you get your own ideas because you start making connections, brain connections, yeah, yeah. and you become more creative. And then, for example, you're, you're, um, you're waiting for the bus stop. You have two, three minutes. What happens? You come up with a really great creative idea of that you can include in the book, and you just do it. You just write it down, and then... Look, look at so at the end of one day you could end up with 1,000 words and literally feels like you've done nothing because all you've done is like small texting yeah and um, at the end of one day you have 1,000 words and at the end of one month you have 30,000 words and that is enough to have yeah. one book yeah. and if you are creative with space you can also create some airspace to make the look even uh, look even bigger so you can end up with a proper proper book now, now what, what, one of Lily's books is uh, about speaking English isn't it can, can you yes can you... the first one is called English from zero to hero which I imagine everyone uh, from your audience already speaks that and you don't need to learn it oh no 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 my audience is global so, okay okay so that's please. fine um, and now I have an upcoming one which is called turbocharge your sales and um, tools to build a great business so I think that some really exciting content is coming up because I realized recently that I, I just have... think you should teach them how to sell because it's it, it's almost in your in your DNA you can't you you, you, <laughs> can't you, stop. Like, you can't sell. <laughs> yeah, because the thing is that I'm not selling I'm just being enthusiastic about the things I love in my life you know and that's yeah. I think something that everyone needs to do you know like for example if you're um, if you um, tried on a really nice pair of trousers, right, and you're, they're really good, they're really awesome, you would recommend it to, their, to your friends, right? In the same way, that's what I'm doing. I just, I'm excited about everything that is awesome in my life. So I've recently realized I know some really, really important people. So if, you know, their knowledge can help you, then that's how I set up my new YouTube channel, which is lily.global. And uh, 
this is something that I'm very excited about. I'm as actually well. going to put all your links on, on this broadcast. So uh, uh, when I finish this, as you know, uh, many people, I come back and I edit the the Facebook lives and I, I put all these links uh, in the comments underneath. So so uh, I will be giving her YouTube channel. She's learned some great techniques to. Uh, overnight, get 5,000 views on her uh, on her for every video she posts. Uh, can you? I, I tell you what. Could you share some uh, some tips of knowledge that you think would help new entrepreneurs or or even seasoned entrepreneurs that you've you've learned recently? Okay. Well, uh, the most important thing is that if you don't know something, just think in your in your. Um, network of friends who already know something that you need and that's the most important thing that I've learned right now the second thing is that if you don't know how to do marketing just get a coach and this is what I've done I'm part of a really amazing uh, marketing um, yeah. coaching you can program see my arms going there <laughs> I'm part of a really amazing marketing coaching program. I can send you a link uh, at the end so you can check it out but it's really amazing it has enabled me to uh, get 5,000 views on a post and by utilizing uh, some, some ranking some yeah. ranking ninja techniques <laughs> ninja I'm very excited tech. about that <laughs> and uh, as time goes by literally from like last week I've, I've done some amazing interviews with people and it keeps going up and up and mm. I will continue to uh, share a lot of interviews with um, some important people yeah. that maybe more, many people don't have access to but I do and I've just figured you know I might as well uh, leverage and the other thing the third thing that I think is really important is leverage you know how can you get more leverage for example the way I get leverage is by utilizing an outsourcer you can get an outsourcer for example from uh, many websites like for example fiverr.com or odesk or um, freelancer.com or guru and you know the, there are many people that uh, you can you can hire and I've traveled to the Philippines so I know exactly what I'm talking about um, when I traveled there, there were people who were making $10 a month as a salary. So for them, you know, if you pay them $500 a month or $700 a month and they, they get to work for 40 hours a week, for example, they're really for them happy. it's like, they're, wow, yeah, they're like same, in same heaven. With people in Ukraine. They're, they're in heaven, right? Yeah. So it's a win-win situation. You, um, in a way, it's almost like you're extending your hand, you're extending your reach. So, so some of you have seen some of my broadcasts on recruiting and building your team. This is another tip from, from Lily here uh, about how to do that. And, and it's just really phenomenal. Can you, can you share how long? So, so, so many questions I've got. I'm only going to uh, ask you two more questions, actually. The first of all, you, is you said uh, people should uh, invest in someone or a program in marketing. How much did you spend on that? So uh, there are several levels, but the one uh, I'm on is um, four nine seven dollars per month. There is another is one. That, which is, is, that, is that like five hundred dollars a month? Yes. Okay, yes. so it's about six. Yeah, just call it five hundred dollars a month. But yeah. you're already getting your your return on your investment. Yes, totally. Straight away by implementing fast, and I think that's really important. If you're if you're learning things, you you need to implement fast with what you're learning. Yeah, and actually there are a few levels. There's one for ninety seven dollars a month. There's another one for nine nine seven. So depending on the size of your business, if you want to be making an extra million, maybe you want to consider just getting the nine nine seven one, uh, because this guy has results, and I have personally seen that because I've recently shared the stage with Les Brown and my partner Harry as well um, has presented his speakers at does a program there and um, you know he through the strategies that he has learned there he has uh, he has managed to sell more than he normally has mm. so so I've seen that working very well so, I'm so, very excited. so how long did it take from your time as an uh, au pair to to getting you know a significant uh, wealth um, okay, so I've uh, done that for eight years, simply because I just didn't have the. You can say I didn't Initial have the belief. Or yeah, belief, I didn't have so, the belief. So, I think so, yeah. the belief was the the biggest thing. Yeah. I didn't have the belief, and what happened was, I I wrote my first book, and that was the wrong book. That was totally the wrong book. I mean, I only sold 12, 20 copies to my 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 friends and family. But so fantastic it was that you did it. Yes. Because most people don't even 
they just say it's going to be rubbish it's going to but you only learn by starting that journey so yes. well done for you yes yeah, so the book was called meet the nanny and even I love though, the title. yes, it's funny. So, <laughs> and he had a really great cover that I managed to pull this off, by, you know, by myself. It took me about a month to pull this off, but I did. And everyone loved the cover and everything. But, um, and even though it was the wrong book, what happened was it had a, a massive impact on my life. And in the same way, I think writing a book can have a massive, massive, massive impact on your life because it enabled me to get my first you can say professional job where um, and that's how I started to run uh, my partner's my partner Harry's business uh, called um, Purple Stone Rooms and Purple Stone Academy and so on and um, now speakers are leaders so this is how I uh, this book enabled me to start managing Harry's business businesses and uh, that's how I kind of started and that's how I managed to buy my property um, and that's how I've become an international speaker now, which I think is really awesome. It's and, awesome. Yeah. Look at that. <laughs> and, so uh, so um, just share, uh, if, if people want to get hold of you, Lily, can you just share some of your links? I'm, I'm, this is uh, the only you. I'm going to come off of the camera here. Yes. So if you would like to get in touch with me, then you can check me out at uh, www.lily.global. Lily is written L-I-L-Y. Or you can check me out also in YouTube with the same link, uh, Lily, L-I-L-Y dot global. And um, that would be it. So you can yeah. check me out there. You can and check uh, I will send you the, if you're interested in my marketing consultant that has sold a hundred million online and could enable you to explode your business, then I will paste the link uh, below. That's fantastic. So guys, thank you for, for tuning in and watching. Uh, as as uh, before, if you like and found this useful, or, or found uh, the lovely Lily useful, then please, 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 please do reshare it on, on your own Facebooks or share it with other people so that they can also learn and grow in their own uh, life. Uh, Lily, thank you so much for, for agreeing to do this impromptu uh, Facebook Live. Thank you so much, Ben. Thank you.